Aún no muero. Inga, I know that song. Clara, I think I found Maximas Matanza's hiding spot. But Castillo's soldiers got here first. Looks like they're having some fun before they call for backup. You know what to do, Danny. Whatever it takes. Cojone, I'm not the first to find them. Hey, watch yourself, Danny. Careful, Princess. You will ruin your singing voice. I don't sing, motherfucker. I rap. So stay awake. You can do it. What are you doing? Fuck those guys up! That's the last of them.
You're you gonna cut me down or what, carajo? Ah, ding! You must be Talia. Move. What the fuck? Hey, uh, you think I can keep this? No, yes. Hey, man, you just saved Maximus Matanzas, the most blessed motherfucking group in Yara. Well, I would have done it myself personally, but, you know, I couldn't stop crying. Get out of my way. I'm Bicho, man. I'm from Mexico. Get me the fuck out of here. I know you can hear me. If I let you out, you're gonna be half? Mi amor. Fuck you, Talia. Oh, I thought you wanted to hide like a pussy-ass bitch. You want to die before we get to America? Oh, big man, Paolo. So a real man takes care of his chica by hiding her in a stank-ass swamp. Fucking puta. <laughs> Coño. Oh, oh. That's just foreplay. Okay, okay. You guys ever heard of Libertad? Clara Garcia sent me... Shh. We were Libertad before Libertad. Who do you think dragged Clara to her first protest when she wanted to live in a fucking library? I don't care. Clara knows her boring ass speeches won't convince Yarns to join Libertad. She needs her voice. Don't worry, Talia's full of shit and so are you. Welcome to Camp Maximus. <laughs> <laughs> They're animals. Everybody! Soldados are gone! Come on out! Paolo's busy again, isn't he? He sent you to help me? Oh, shit. Clara, good news. Maximus Matanzas is safe and they've actually got a decent camp here. here. No? Bad news. They wow. don't give a shit about Libertad. Give it time, Danny. They've been through a lot. We can't beat Castillo without Talia's voice Fucking and Paolo's discipline. You just need to help them find it. Okay, Clara. I'm gonna trust you know what the hell you're getting me into. You here to pick up Paolo's slack? We got a lot to... Do it here. So you were actually there? She, yeah. Hey there. That was the lucky place to be. Fire started near the back of the crowd. Danny. Oh. Ready to get your hands dirty? You're still full of shit. A lot more people here than I thought. Are the musicians too? Talia collects dreamers dumb enough to pick fights with Anton's Ministry of Culture. I just make sure they aim the barrel away from the face. Thought I was the only dropout. Papa was a drill instructor. Family's fifth gen army until me. What happened? Expelled. When Papa found out I turned from his favorite daughter into a freak. His words. Shit. Just trans in the military, compai. I was lucky. Talia caught me trying to steal her gear, but instead of turning me in, she gave me a deck. Libertad can help all of you here. Libertad? When Castillo won, we left riots with Clara. And what did it get us? Clara runs off to play guerrilla, Talia gets thrown into Maria Marquesa's bullshit academy, and I have to take a big fucking debt to get her out. From who? Bembe, black market smuggler. Once he's paid off, Talia and I are off this fucking rock. Let me take some debt, Paolo. I don't do handouts. Okay. 
Why'd you leave the military? Punch my drill instructor in the throat. I'm not a morning person. Segunda, Ben Betil's in the church. Ready to go? That's a good horse. Asking for forgiveness. Danny, Dahlia. So now you want to talk to me? No, I want to see you. Meet me at the zoo by the The rider beats you around. Look, if this is some kind of fucked up date. Just get that ass over here and don't tell Paolo. You drive me back to that fucking swamp. Clara! I need to help Paolo pay off a debt to some black market smuggler named Bembe. Do whatever it takes, Danny. If Paolo was able to build that camp on the run, imagine what he could do for Libertad when he decides to fight. Understood, Clara. You Bembe? I know a silly when I see one. What's wrong with Ola, asshole? He tried to fuck me, Danny Rojas. I sell your organs to the Yankees. And I know if I shoot you, Paolo's death disappears. No. You have rules. You might kill, but you're no killer. Mierda, you got me. So what does that make you? I kill guerrillas. I also kill soldiers. It's just business. Easy to pretend you're not picking sides. My father was a guerrilla in 67. After the revolution, he put on a crisp military uniform. Thirty years later, to his surprise, a fresh new revolution with fresh new guerrillas. They thank him with a bullet to the skull. Buried in the same crisp uniform. Are you ready for your uniform, Rojas? It goes both ways. How's that? You were just dressed like a priest. <laughs> I like you, Danny Rojas. We can do business. Fucking Bambe. <sighs> Orgullo del Toro rum is overpriced. Look here, Rojas. I need you to pick up my key from my business partners. Where are they? At the hotel. My associates are named Dimitri and Vasily. They're Russian and they're twins. I'll make it easy and send a picture. You're too kind. They say kindness is the lowest form of manipulation. This is a simple job, Rojas. Get me my key and Paolo will thank you. I don't want Paolo's thanks. 
I want Paolo's deck cleared. We all do, Rojas. Me most of all. Right. I'll get you this key. But then you and Paolo are square. Understand? Love you, Rojas. Bye-bye. Yeah. 
Might be. Hey, I'm just trying to help you. You don't help people, Bembe. You use them. I'll take that as a thank you. Soldiers, simple job, my ass. Bembe will pay for what is done to you. Are you Vasily? Dimitri or Vasily? Dimitri, who the fuck are you? Bembe sent me. Where's the key? <laughs> so that's what this is about. Bembe fucked us good. First he sends military, then he sends you. I don't work for Bembe. I'm just here for the key. My brother has the key. The soldiers drowned him like a dog. But he didn't once beg for his life. He died in that fancy pool like a man. My Vasily. Gracias. I'm sorry about your brother. I'm getting out of Yara. You should too before Bembe stabs you in the back. Idiota to suck! I never should have come to this godforsaken country! Bembe, you fucking hijo de puta. Ah, so you got my key. See, I found it on your dead Russian friend. Now, Rojas, the key opens a safe at Via Hudia Hotel. I need a black book inside. What's in that book? For you? Paolo's freedom.
Going you. I see you. Oye, where do you go? You got stress, Danny? Maybe you should visit Dr. Yanni Dawelos. He can help you get your mind right. Thanks a lot. Hope you're here to help us. Now, easy. Looks like the hotel, and what a surprise. The army is here. Bembe, I'm at the hotel. And so is the army. But I think you already knew that. It's the delicious little surprises I've been left like living. Save me your bullshit. Let me guess. You want me to take them out.
American weapons. Shit. Libertad could use those. Should check it out. The safe's in the restaurant. Juan, got a lead on a weapon shipment. American. Interested? Interested? Danny, I'm having a hands-free orgasm in this church. Call me when you find them. Gross. But, uh, yeah, okay. Pinga. Bembe, it's done. I got your book. Muy bien, Rojas. I can see why Clara has so... much faith in you. You're such a good little gopher. Is that what you think I am? Prove me wrong. I don't have to prove anything to you. Tell me where to meet you. I'm across the north bridge of the hotel. All this for a book. Que tal, Rojas? Sorry. Thank you for securing my new port. Thought you wanted the book from the safe. Can the man have both? Of course, Via Hudia Hotel is the real prize jewel. It's the best smuggling port on the south coast. You just needed someone to clear out the competition. The Russians make good money from this place. And with this book of corrupt officials in their pay, that money will now flow to me. We are done here. But you and I still have business to do, Rojas. You've paid off some of Paolo's debt, but not all. Don't worry, I have more work for you. 